Recording in progress. Okay, I can see that we start to connecting with each other. I will wait a bit as, uh, as usual for the start. Um, it will be great if somebody will let me know if uh, you can hear me well and you can see me well. If there's anything you would like to ask or let me know, you can use the question and answer. There are like two clouds. Um, this will be the best way. Just a minute more. We have perhaps still somebody to, to join. see something over here we can hear you and we can see you thank you very much for letting me know chat is disabled and chat will be disabled um, we are using question and answers now um, please put your questions you know during the webinar whatever we have to ask or let me know um, after my presentation i have some time Spare to, uh, to look at your questions and I promise to answer all of them. I think that will be quite a um, quite, quite good time to start. Um, so, very officially, good afternoon. My name is Jagoda Zapawa. I'm working in Eton as a customer success. And uh, I'm very happy you joined me today. We will talk about our templates, blogs, creator. Uh, as I said before, please um, write your questions, don't be shy. Um, after, after my presentation, I will not stop doing it, but after presentation, I will have a look on every question and um, give my best to answer it. I will share my screen and the presentation. Here we go. Would you please let me know if you see my first slide with the subject of today's webinar, which is templates and blocks? Fabulous. Templates and blocks. So, this is the way you can surprise your clients with brand new email designs. This is the way to help you create an email. Um, templates are uh, the ready, um, ready skeleton of the message. You just have to edit uh, to your shop, and the blocks are saved. Part of these messages you can add easily to every of your message. Uh, very short, short page that was. Don't worry, I will uh, say a lot of more about it because this is the main subject. During, um, during the, the webinar, I will show you as well how to turn on step by step two of our uh, scenarios, uh, recommendation and refer a, a friend. So as I said, if you will have any questions, if there will be anything that's not really um, that you understood, please ask your question. I'll be very happy to answer it. The short agenda of today is, put, of course, about templates to start with. So uh, I will tell you where to start. Um, <laughs> uh, I will answer your question if it's worth it to use them. Of course, it is. I hope uh, you will feel as much excited as I am about them. Um, there will be a little surprise for you, uh, tips from our support team, uh, how we do some things, our little sneak peeks of our uh, uh, speed up our work. Uh, the next um, main uh, filler of uh, today's webinar will be about blocks. So um, how to use them, when it's good to choose blocks over the templates, um, which, which ones are the best, and how to save your own, uh, the practical use, some, um, some actual examples, what's the best to save the block and use it in, in other creations. And, uh, 
the least, and last but not least, the thing about um, getting from the new creator to uh, from the old creator to the new creator. Uh, I will uh, allow myself to stop in here. And if um, is there um, with, today with us somebody who's actually working on the old creator with Idram? I wonder. Can't can't see any anybody saying that. So I will get through that anyway. Um, I hope all of you are already on the creator and drag and drop. Uh, however, there will be still step by step explaining um, how to quite easy and quick um, move from one to the other. So why are you here? Um, for whom this um, this webinar is? Who will be get the best? Um, not only from the beginners, but of course the beginners will get like the most from today um, because uh, you will see where to start with creating the, an email. You will be able to see how to turn on two of our scenarios step by step with us. So that's quite a lot of uh, package of knowledge. Of course, with the clients that are with us a few months, um, remember redesign is quite important. Mm, if you keep, if you if you have your clients with you, for example, they are subscribers or keep visiting your, they are keep visiting your website for let's say a few months. Um, if you still have the same design, same colors, the same look of the email, they will probably get bored. Let's say, um, let's be honest with that one. It would be really great surprise for your clients. They will get more attention to the actual email. They will see something new. Uh, for the clients that are with us a year or longer, so um, very often we can uh, we are we the support I mean the supporting C situation when um, clients turning on our system, they are turning on some scenarios. They are you know the impact rate is great, the revenue it's uh, uh, the trends are great reviews, and this is where when they stop. It's not what we want to see. We, we would like to encourage you to redesign, to turn on some other scenarios, not only the basic ones you actually have turned on uh, on working, let's say. Um, and of course, for the clients of an old creator. This is the moment when I will actually say that, which is quite important information, which is that um, this is the critical moment to move from the old creator. Our IT team, uh, we as Idron, are not supporting anymore this functionality. The new creator has been created um, um, sometime quite long ago, and uh, we are not solving any issues with our creator. All features or new possibilities as the templates we will talk about today, they are not available on the old creator. Um, mm -hmm. And uh, if you will ask me why is it worth to turn on more scenarios? Why was the point? Uh, if I have like my best three or best four, I don't want to spam my clients. Um, what, is, what is actually the point of um, why those horizons of messages? Well, to start with, please remember that every single scenario uh, brings some revenue. So turning on more scenarios brings you revenue increase. Um, then every single scenario, even if uh, on the first look you think they are very similar, like for example, we have uh, after sale scenario um, that's sending a message after sale. And then we have a comment, uh, recommendation option that's sending the message after sale as well. And for the first look, you might think that they are doing the same thing. What's the point? Well, this is actually wrong. Uh, because they are having um, different, they are different built by themselves. Um, they working on different actions and so on. So uh, obviously, every single one of them uh, that's available on your um, engaged site, they have different um, different idea of working. They acting after different different action, types of actions uh, um, of your clients on the website. Uh, basically, they building stronger relationship and loyalty with your clients on the same um, um, on the same actual 
um, meaning as, um, as the thing I said before. Because different actions, you have the birthday scenario, you have uh, referral friends, so loyalty program, they are all uh, keep um, contacting with your clients. They are not leaving them you know, just after they make a purchase. So this is actually building quite strong bond with them. Obviously, we have more data to get to know our clients and um, you are able to get to know our system and what the clients prefer the most. So uh, coming back to the templates, where to start, where, uh, where you can, um, what, what actually is the template, or where you can find it. Uh, I will tell you uh, how you can modify them and uh, Please remember to modify them because they are just as skeletons. Uh, remember that you can copy scenarios with the, the design between scenarios. I will show you one more time where and how. And uh, I will show you how you can use them in your own e-commerce. Uh, what's, what guide, uh, guided us? What, what actually Mm, what was the main thing we've been uh, taking under our circumstances for creating those templates? The main establish uh, was uh, was obviously you, which is our clients. We wanted to make email creation easier. Easier. We would like. Uh, we wanted to go forward for you. So with the few clicks, actually, um, I will show you the short movie uh, after this blog. Mm, that shows it takes about two or three minutes to actually turn on your scenario with this template. So that's really short your time, your working time on it. Uh, we worked very hard to make as many editable elements as possible. So if you like the look of this um, template, even if it's made for some specific uh, scenario, you can always edit it uh, to your likings and to the order uh, subject yet that you will like. Make them the most of the creator. Uh, we've been seeing that when um, some clients like uh, create their own design, there's still some, uh, sometimes they're still missing some very important elements. So with those templates, with those wide range um, of templates, you will not miss any, um, any important elements. Of course, we would like to make your uh, way a lot quicker with creating these messages. Um, so you will be a lot more willing to turn on some more scenarios. You will, you will not be afraid of, uh, oh my goodness, I don't really have a time for it. Um, so uh, the next thing is that templates with their names, they are created under some specific scenario. So we are, uh, we would like to inspire you as well, uh, give you some more ideas, not only the, the ones you can find on our portfolio, but uh, as well as templates you can uh, get inspired. Um, okay, so uh, if you would like to find your templates when you are logged into your main dashboard that you can see on my little computer in here. Uh, you have to click, of course, the, the engage button on the right side. And then we can see our, all scenarios. So just any you would like, because in each of them we have design section. And uh, in here you already could, um, can see the templates. Um, these are those all little messages in the line uh, under the yellow line. But if you will not see them, they are somehow will be minimized. All you have to do is click uh, template button and you will be able to see them. Um, so uh, the main thing, please remember that templates are out viable only on the creator. If you are using the old one, you will have to move to the new one uh, and then you will be uh, very welcome to use them. Um, it, there is lots of them. So as you can see on the, on the bottom, there is a little um, um, moving thing from the left to right. So uh, I hope uh, you will explore them um, um, and while you will explore them, you will see some 
um, some names, so specific things. Let me explain you what exactly that means. So let's start with uh, the main thing that we have uh, templates in two languages. So they are not only in English. Uh, the English is the main language for now because we have um, templates for all the scenarios in English. You can find some in Polish and uh, in Romanian. And please remember that we didn't stop just right there. We keep creating more and more templates. So, um, so uh, and every time you will actually work on some design, work on some creation, have a little sneak peek because probably something new will appear. And with those, um, with those names, what we actually mean. So every template has an English describing name. What scenario is it? So uh, in here with those examples I showed you, we have recover abundant cards, or for example, newsletter, the last chance newsletter, uh, what we call last chance newsletter, we send a newsletter before humanization of our database of subscribers. So um, Mm, if uh, any other template will show, for example, newsletter subscription and so on, so on. Um, if uh, in default some scenario has more than one message, like for example, chat subscription or newsletter subscription, uh, you will see what kind of message that template is um, assigned to. For example, in here we have chat subscription welcome and chat subscription confirmation um, and the last thing that you can see in the square um, in the square thing it's uh, what kind of language is it here it's time to stop because of course they are to inspire they are made under some specific scenario as you can see even with the messages and uh, with, uh, with the languages, but you can look at them a little bit wider. Every single element, as I said, it's a table. So all you can have to do is change the copy, change the banner, the main, uh, the banner, I mean, the main uh, photo that it's shown. And uh, if you like the, um, the colors of it, uh, the way it's actually made, you can still edit, edit it for a different scenario. It's not like you cannot use it in a mixing way. You all, um, all you have to do is adjust it. What is our trick from our uh, from support? We're using notebooks. <laughs> For example, you have turned on a lot of your scenarios. Um, and obviously, we don't want to pause them for a long time because they bring us revenue. Uh, for example, um, recover cards or newsletter subscription. It's a little bit stressful to put pause on it and keep working on a design section. Uh, so our tip is to choose some scenario you don't use or in the cross setting, make like, um, if you don't use cross setting, make like uh, as many rules as you need and every, every each of it can be your notebook. This is where you can, in design section, create the message you would like, for example, with that recover, uh, recover cards. And when it's ready, you just have to copy it and pass that in, uh, in the original scenario you're working in. Uh, so, um, as I promised you, there will be a video to film uh, showing um, of how to use the templates. Uh, we will do it now together and I hope that will actually encourage you to use the templates, encourage you to do those redesigns, to make on more scenarios. It will not scare you anymore that it's a lot of work um, because that video actually were, had just a few minutes. I'm guessing it's around three, not even that much. And this is exactly the time you will have to spend to create new message. I hope you will uh, be able to hear as well. Oops, oh, I'm sorry, sorry, I tried to just make it. Welcome to the session. I will show you how to make 
application process can be found in simple, final, and fantastic. This is already many templates and blocks. You will prepare an attractive message in literally a few steps. It's bigger. You will see an incident we equate to the verb message creation in the way. At the top of the design section, it's a list of ready made templates to choose from. You will choose the one that cut your attention. Or you can also follow the names under the template. For example, no selling, birthday, let's start, and more. Click on the template of your choice and then go to edit. All elements have been created so you can easily edit it yourself. As a first step, we recommend changing your logo element to your search logo. All you have to do is click on the selected element. Menu will appear on the left side. Here, upload your graphic by clicking on the upload image button. The left of the section is the category. Click on it to remain the categories available to those for your store. Here, you can also enter the URL, which will vary with customers to the categories on your site. The next step is to change the main button. After clicking on this item, you can import the graphic or use our image map, which you can find in the bar on image section. To add it, just drag and drop the graphic to the appropriate place in the grid. Each caption on the banner is also added. You can change the content, font, size, and color. Hello. Edit the message content according to your preference. If you need inspiration, take a look at the portfolio. Here you will see what kind of content is the most popular. It's necessary to replace some elements in the creation. For example, space for the select. Remember that if you want to remove the select element of the creation, click on it and then on the bottom with the trash can icon. You can drag another select item into the empty space. After this puzzle, you also have the option to add the static products, which you will find in blocks. After dragging them, you just need to fill them with graphics and products data, such as product description or URL. Another important element of the message are infographics. That will present what makes your story stand out. For example, it could be shipping, secure payment, high quality, or fashion. You can freely edit the text from the direct. Now, it's the turn of the button. We can, for example, redirect the customer to your source website. You can change the content, the font, also, you can change the size, the color. Or even the shape. Remember to add a URL link to the final destination. An important part of the message is the contact information. Here, edit the text to include contact information for your story. Also, remember to include social media. You can add items of your choice and, of course, use the link to send your clients to your store store. At the very end of the message, add information about the personal data and scroll. Examples of this information are included in each template. Just change the data element. That's it. The creation is ready. Is that simple? To make things even easier for you, we have prepared for you a template box that will help you process of a new creation. With them, you can create your message completely from scratch. All you have to do is drag and drop the block to the desired place. Then, customize in according to your needs. Good luck with your creation. Remember, if you have any questions, you can email us to hello at email.me or use our There we go. So this is the movie to the end. You already had a little sneak peek to the box. 
<laughs> don't worry, I will come back to the subject. But before all that, I would like to still highlight some very important things that um, hasn't been really said in this um, short video, uh, but I would like you to remember. First of all, every single template that you will choose is already responsive for a mobile version. Mm. That's mean if these are elements that don't look really well, um, they just redirecting they, um, how they are viewed. Uh, remember, we have possibility to copy and template. So when you will create your vision, then you all you have to do is just keep copy and paste it to, um, to the other scenarios and modifying the main elements, which is normally the subject, the copy, and if you wish, the, uh, the banner, um, the third main element is dynamic, dynamic element, which will be different for uh, scenarios like view products or appointed cards or recommendation. Um, what was very interesting in this video, and I would like to remind you as well, we have a bunch of graphics that are here for you to use. So, um, you can find on the left side on the left side of the creator um, there's really lots of them you can use the uh, search uh, search view so if you that will be a smiley face or computers or cosmetics uh, please feel free to use them this is uh, quite a lot of them over there so you can skip the graphic design part if you don't have any of you that you don't really want to wait for uh, for any graphics to be ready in your company. Uh, you can always choose to hide some elements on the mobile version or on the desktop version. So um, you can still adjust just one template, you can adjust for um, to look a little bit different on both of those devices. And please remember that you are able to modify or change the preheader. Um, as I said there on the beginning, they, uh, uh, we will get through today, uh, get through together in turning on two of our scenarios. Let's start with the first one, a recommendation. Uh, before I will go to step by step, I would like to convince you for that. Uh, why? Well, uh, this is the only one scenario of ours that um, using machine learning and artificial intelligence. It's actually and I, uh, it's uh, based on basket analysis. So there's uh, our system that keep learning your, your own client's uh, shopping behavior. So uh, this is why it brings the highest revenue because obviously your clients know the best which, are, which products are um, you know, going on together very well or uh, what they needed after uh, another purchase. It really increases revenue. Um, I'm um, working as a customer success, so one of my main uh, responsibilities are um, account analysis. So when I'm meeting with my clients and we are getting through uh, the revenues, we are getting through some reports, and we having a closer look for every single scenario, how it looks with revenue, with open rate, and uh, so on. The recommendation it's nearly always in the first place uh, in that pyramid. So no doubt you should uh, turn it on and uh, on, the, on the high level. Uh, each message is different because this is the highest level of personalization. Why it's different? Because that dynamic, dynamic element recommendation um, is based on the baskets of uh, other clients regarding one specific product that this client viewed at the basket or both. So uh, this is your, uh, uh, that's uh, how it looks like when you log into your dashboard. We are of course going to engage section and here we have our star recommendations. The first step is get started. I will stop in here for a little uh, while because on this example, you can see, um, you can have a look and sneak peek what, uh, what our system will recommend to your clients regarding uh, the specific product. So on here, on this very uh, example, on the first row, 
uh, you can uh, you can see the product that, for example, has been viewed by your clients, and below that are the products that will show as recommended to, to him. Uh, in at just section, of course, you can uh, choose engagement uh, parameters. Uh, this you have three options. I strongly recommend to turn three of them. So uh, send the message after product view, send the message after up to cart, and send the message after order. Please remember to have a look how you have adjust your um, scenarios with view products with uh, recover among the cards, and if you have after sale. Just to make sure that there will be space, some uh, you know, some time space between sending uh, those messages. I would think the best way would be to send recommendations after the other ones. And next uh, will be uh, choosing a language. If you using multi languages, if your clients using multi languages, this is the base you can uh, you can obviously choose that option. If not. Uh, the single language will be the way. On the sender section, you remember to choose uh, from whom that email scenario that all emails will be sent. Normally, if you will put, uh, put on the click on arrow, you will see uh, the senders you used in other scenarios, so you can always choose it. If not, uh, underneath on preferred uh, senders, you can add. There we have the section design. Uh, which we actually see on the on the movie. So this is the place when you can um, choose some template or um, create your message from scratch using the blocks any way you like. In coupons, you have to uh, download so um, some um, file of coupons if you choose to use them. And the review. Please remember to send yourself a test. It's the practice we are using as well. So even if on the design section everything looks perfectly well, uh, we strongly recommend to send the test uh, first to yourself to have a look how the actual message looks like on your um, on your inbox. If every um, element you linked well, so for example, if you will press the category on menu, it will be directly to the proper one you, you wish to. You know, uh, we are all just humans and we all make mistakes, so it's always to double check yourself. When you are happy, nothing more left than uh, uh, press resume, and this is that's it. Your um, your scenario is running already. Um, the last section are reports. I'm hoping that you are using them. You are uh, keep. Uh, uh, to checking your revenues, um, uh, having you know um, just that knowledge how the things looks um, and which scenarios brings you the best. If um, if you are not happy with some, there is always some um, way to change it. Please contact us if you have any questions uh, to improve the, those revenues. Um, I came back a little bit for. Uh, I came back to design section. Um, my friend on the film showed that already, but I would like to, to say it one more time because this is quite important. Please remember that these templates are the skeletons. So th there are elements that you have to edit. Uh, of course, the logo, which, um, <laughs> which is quite uh, obvious. Um, the, the banner, which is the main picture. Uh, the menu not only change the name of categories, just please remember to put the uh, URL um, where to redirect, <laughs> redirect um, with the dynamic element. Um, just the drag and drop from the left side uh, and remember to delete the one you can see in here because this is just a picture. This is not the dynamic element. This is very, very important. Um, next, we have uh, infographics. You don't have to edit them. You have to remember to link them to your website. Uh, same like with contact and uh, uh, edit your data controller. So um, who's actually responsible for holding the, the customer uh, data. It is really so easy and fast. I hope that uh, the templates will show you 
uh, well, a courage you to uh, redesign, to make creations, uh, to turn on scenarios that um, it will actually make it quicker and easier. Um, remember about changes. Um, remember to have a look at each of the elements of the template, even if it's look perfectly. Uh, they are, uh, as I said, the dynamic products. They are not dynamic products, even if that element looks very similar uh, than it is on the creator. This is just a picture, so you have to drop and drop the dynamic uh, element and this thing you have to delete. Uh, action button, even if you like it, if you, if you don't want to, um, if, even if you don't want to change it looks, please remember to choose the action because this is just a skeleton, just a, um, just a template. So even if the button will say subscribe, even if the button will say go to the store, you still have to choose that action because it's not on the default. Um, what are the blocks? Uh, beyond this game, <laughs> uh, where to use blocks rather than the templates? Where to start with when you have obviously your own uh, vision? So, uh, or if you like just one element of the template, you can use it as a block. Uh, we have uh, 10 of them uh, that are already there for you in the section blocks that we created but you can save your own blocks and then use them. I will show you that, don't worry. Um, blocks are great to use on every stage of the creating or modifying the emails. Um, if you change your details, um, if you change your contact, or if you just like, um, want to redesign but only one section, this is all the situations when you should use blocks. The advantages of, uh, of using them is, of, of course, the, uh, they are very helpful when you're actually making a creation from the scratch, which means you don't use a template, you have your own vision, or you are going through the old creator and you want to have exactly the message you had and you um, recreating this uh, message one by one. Blocks will be great for you in this, um, in this situation. The blocks are great when you're adding a static product. Uh, in newsletters, very often we are using static products. We want to, some exact products that um, to be uh, sent to our customers that we want to promote, uh, blocks are there for you. Uh, you saving this element, as I said, about changing data, adding specific element to the creation or uh, you know, the high personalization of the message uh, when you, um, you have your own idea. <laughs> so where to find them, this is quite, um, uh, this is um, on the left side when you have uh, the graphics um, and the, uh, and the edit, um, elements to be um, changed. Uh, blocks are just um, uh, above. How to save a block? So, for example, in here you, you prepared your menu um, with the colors, with the links, and everything you actually need. So uh, if you um, put your mouse on this element, you can see the three icons. Uh, you have to press uh, the disk icon, then you have to put the name of your block and press save. It should be shown straight away in section box. Uh, the trick from support, if you are adding the static products, you can, it would be the best if you will use our box because first of all, they're already responsible for the mobile version. So they are, um, they are showing upright position in mobile uh, next to each other on desktop. And then of course, there are more than one box in that. So you can choose if you want to show those graphics, text and the button or just graphics, you can adjust them in any way you like. Uh, the one more trick um, that will, the blocks will help you with is your contact details change. Or, for example, if you add some, uh, you know, some social media, until now you didn't really have that element um, in your creations, and now you're ready to turn that on, or uh, want to change just menu or logo, you, in any of the scenarios, make the changes, save that block, and then all you have to do is drag and drop in the other ones. 
Um, the next start of the webinar, the next scenario I would like to turn on with you step by step, it's refer a friend. So uh, just a few words about the scenario, why I choose that scenario and why I would like you to turn it on. Um, it's a little bit underrated in, in, um, with, uh, with our clients uh, because when using refer a friend, every single side wins. Um, how it works, maybe let's start in this way. Our client, it's um, referring your shop to his friend. That friend is signing up to our newsletter, so our base is increasing, making a purchase, so our obviously our um, sales increases. And if um, that sale, if that order will reach the minimum um, that you choose, the other friend will get the coupon and discount as well. So probably they will make one more order and uh, one more time your sale increases. So uh, it, uh, it's working this way because it's uh, working on positive psychological effect, obviously. The customers feel safe because it's friends refer. So they straight away go beyond if the products are good quality, if the shop is uh, worth to, um, to or to buy in, all these questions are already answered because obviously our friend uh, referred us, so I'm quite positive about it. Uh, it grows your subscription base, which is um, something we all should work on it. Please remember that cookies less era is beyond us, so every single subscriber for us, it should be uh, as a gold coin. Uh, we can promote it in any place, really. So um, when we turn on that scenario, can keep promoting and keep promoting from some from some time to time, and it's uses principle of whispered marketing. Uh, this is the best form of commercial. Please remember that with whisper marketing, you are very widening your horizons of gaining new customers because it's beyond the Google, it's beyond the social media. You are friends and family of our customers, probably let's say the people we, we wouldn't be able to reach further away. Step by step, and the first step of course, you are half long of our workspace, no other way. Uh, we are going to engage and choose a refer, a refer a friend scenario, which is on the left bottom. Get started. This is good to have a look and read it through because it's actually explaining um, how it actually works, how it looks from the customer side. Um, it will be exactly the same what I just uh, explained you on the beginning. With the, why you have to choose the opt-in? Because remember, one of the steps of all that uh, all that ma mm, machine is signing to a new status subscription. So this is why we have to choose the model of subscription. Just remember the one that we actually recommend, it's double opt-in with either. Next step is choosing the language, if that's single or multi, and the adjust section. What you are choosing in here? Uh, it's the minimum value of the order. Um, because uh, if your client is referring your shop to his friend, his friend, her friend, uh, they are gaining a coupon for new service subscription, of course. And then if they will make an order, but for the minimum value that you, you remember to inform that in the message, the friend that actually made a referral will get another coupon. So this is the place when you put in that minimum value of order. And next adjust section is the, the time when the coupon will be sent after uh, the purchase has been made. Sender, you have to choose your sender from the, you know, from the list. Um, we have, oh, I'm sorry, the design section, um, which we all, uh, uh, I hope, know already how it looks like. You still have templates to use for that scenario as well. Coupons, obviously, this is the best one. You will have to uh, down, upload your, uh, your file with coupons, then we have to on-site create the welcome one and the one with coupon. When everything is ready, please remember to send yourself a test, double check if every message 
it's uh, well directed as it should be. If it looks all right on the both devices, desktop and mobile, when everything's ready, you can press run. And then last section, of course, are reports. I encourage you to check them from time to time. Um, that will be all for um, for the um, for the theoretical news. Um, as the last step of our today meeting, I would like to show you already some um, some uses of our templates. For example, in here, somebody used the template just as a block because uh, our client liked it just uh, the call to action. So uh, he saved this block, adjusted to uh, his likings with other color and other text. And here we have blocks of static stick products used by our clients adjusted as well to their likings. In here, these are uh, this is the same uh, template, just adjust um, by our clients. Um, how to move to the new creator? This is the part for uh, for the clients that are already using or they're still using old creator. I would like to remind one more time how important it is to, to, to do that step. Now we are no longer um, performing on all creator. Our IT don't solve the struggles and problems with it. So uh, the, this is the last minute call. Why the new uh, creator is better if what I said already didn't um, encourage you? Obviously with drag and drop, it's easier way to creating emails. Uh, we have clear modification uh, of, of that design section. We have lots of possibilities in use. We have personalized and elements, which is not available on the old one. There is no need of graphic designer. Uh, we, you, uh, you are able to go, in, to go beyond your schemas, and of course you can copy and pass to the um, already done creations one. You can reuse them in other scenarios. It's only drag and drop, so um, um, this, is, uh, this is a very practical way of working on it. And of course, you have new functionalities uh, available on it with time. To start with, you have to go to scenario that is on old creator and send yourself the test message. This is important because you have to download uh, just, to, just to see how it's, uh, that message looked like. Uh, because once you will uh, press the button to move to new creator, you will use your design from the old one. So please remember to send yourself a test. Um, you, um, when you go to design section, there is the button available to download the graphics from this email. So if, uh, if you have any banners, logo, whatsoever, it's in this uh, section, you can download it uh, straight away to the computer. Um, and then what we strongly recommend is to use the notebook, as I said before. So you have to go to some scenario you don't use, go to the design section, and now we have two options, or use some template and make a redesign, or if you're really uh, keen to copy creation one to one, obviously you can as well. But this is the place where you should do it. When it's ready, you just have to click on the copy button, go to the original uh, scenario. This uh, blue button is uh, it's uh, directing to the new creator. You have to click past that, and everything is ready. You can run your scenario. Um, so. Obviously, uh, that, that was the skeleton that's ready. Now you have to just pass it to every other, um, every other one that's on the old creator. Just move to the new one, pass to the skeleton, and uh, choose the main elements. Uh, this is all from my side. Um, are there any questions? I will just have a look in a minute. Uh, please write them, I will try to answer them. Um, for all that, uh, please remember to contact us on eganmaupa.eganmap. You can always call us uh, with any single question you have regarding this webinar, regarding our scenarios, regarding the templates or blocks. We are here for you. Um, do we have any questions? Oh, at some point it was the bad. Of course, yes, of course you can see that movie. Mm, 
um, the, the movie we've been seeing it's, uh, it's uh, you can find it on our FAQ as well if you will um, this webinar will be recent as well uh, alongside with presentation there will be the link available uh, on, on this presentation you will be able to um, turn it on and have it one more time uh, normally the FAQ is ready uh, plus or minus a week after a webinar um, so please um, check your inbox and you'll be able to see it one more time. I cannot see any more questions, so I don't see any uh, reason to um, keep us uh, any longer. Thank you very much for today. Um, I hope I encourage you and um, stay in touch. Thank you very much. Goodbye.